Okay, I will show you now how to get rid of objects that are in a image. So looking at this one, we have a picture of some hot air balloons. Uh, there's a couple different ways that we can do to get rid of it. The first one is, is using a tool called Content Aware. So I'm gonna zoom into the hot air balloon that I wanna get rid of. And I'm just going to select that area. Now I'm just using a box selection tool for this one. And I'm going to go to edit and I want to fill that area. Uh, you'll need to make sure that you're selected on the layer that the hot air balloons are on. Then I want to fill it with content aware. What this will do, it will select all the information from around the outside and it'll try to fill it in the best it can um, to make it look like it wasn't there. So now when I go to select and deselect, um, it doesn't look like the hot air balloon was ever there. Now that was kind of an easy one because it was all empty space around the outside. Uh, what happens if we have a lot of information like around this hot air balloon and there's a lot of ground behind it? Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the lasso tool this time and I'm gonna make a selection a little bit closer to the hot air balloon area that I wanna get rid of. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go up to edit and click on fill again. I'm gonna click content aware. Again, it'll pull the information from around the outside. And when I go to select and deselect, now you'll notice that it looks like the hot air balloon was never there. The second way that you can get rid of an image is to take um, what's called a spot healing brush tool. So over in your toolbar, you'll see something that looks like a Band-Aid. I'm gonna click on the spot healing brush tool and what this will do is it works kind of the same as Content Aware, but instead of selecting the area, I am just going to kind of shade over the top of it. Then when I let go, it will fill the area just like Content Aware. Uh, let's see if we can get rid of these balloons here. So again, I'm going to fill this whole area with the shading from the Spot Healing Brush. And I'm going to let go. And you'll notice how I kind of see a van sitting there. Well, there's a van over here that looks the exact same. So that content aware will pull that information. If you don't want that there, you may need to just use that spot healing brush again. And then now it doesn't look like it's there. If you wanted to get rid of this van down here, you certainly could just cover that area with your spot healing brush as well. So that is how you get rid of images inside of a photograph uh, using the content aware tool or the spot healing brush tool.